Balul Khan Lodi died the 12th of July 1489 was the chief of the Pashtun Lodi tribe founder of Lodi dynasty of the Delhi Sultanate upon the abdication of the last claimant from the previous Sayyid rule Balul became sultan of the dynasty on the 19th of April 1451 Early life Balul's grandfather, Malik Baram, was a Pashtun from Multan, he took service under the governor of Multan, Malik Martin Daulat. Malik Baram had a total of about five sons. His eldest son, Malik Sultan Shah Lodi, later served under the Sayyid dynasty ruler Qazir Khan and distinguished himself by killing in the battle later's worst enemy Malu Iqbal Khan. He was rewarded with the title of Islam Khan and in 1419 appointed the governor of Sirhind. Balul, the son of Malik Kala, the younger brother of Malik Sultan was married to Malik Sultan's daughter. In his youth, Balul was involved in the trading of horses and once sold his finely bred horses to the Sayyid dynasty Sultan Muhammad Shah. As a payment he was granted a pargana and raised to the status of emir. After the death of Malik Sultan, he became the governor of Sirhind. He was allowed to add Lahore to his charge. Once, Sultan Muhammad Shah asked for his help when the Malwa Sultan Mahmud Shah I invaded his territory. Balul joined the imperial army with 20,000 mounted soldiers. By his cleverness, he was able to project himself as a victor over the army of the Malwa Sultan and Sultan Muhammad Shah conferred on him the title of Khan i Kanan. He also accepted Balul's occupation over a large part of Punjab. In 1443, Balul attacked Delhi but he did not succeed. During the reign of last Sayyid ruler Sultan Alam Shah, Balul again made another unsuccessful attempt to capture Delhi in 1447. Finally, when Alam Shah retired to Badan in 1448, a minister of Alam Shah, Hamid Khan invited him to occupy the throne of Delhi. After the voluntary abdication of the throne by Alam Shah, Balul Shah ascended the throne of Delhi on 19 April 1451 and adopted the title of Balul Shah Ghazi. Alam Shah continued to live in Badan till his death in July 1478. The tomb of the founder of the Lodi dynasty lies close to the shrine of the noted Sufi saint, Nasiruddin Chirag e Delhi, in a locality that goes by his name, Chirag Delhi. Reign After ascending to the throne, Balul decided to dispose of Hamid Khan. His cousin and brother-in-law Malik Mahmud Khan alias Qutbud Din Khan governor of Samana imprisoned Hamid Khan. In 1479, Sultan Balul Lodi defeated and annexed Sharqi dynasty based at Janpur. Balul did much to stop rebellions and uprisings in his territories, and extended his holdings over Gwalior, Janpur and Upper Uttar Pradesh. Just like the previous Delhi sultans, he kept Delhi the capital of his kingdom. In 1486, he appointed his son, Babrak Shah as viceroy of Janpur. In time, this proved to be problematic, as his second son, Nizam Khan Sikander Lodi was named successor, and a power struggle ensued upon his death in 1489. Marriages <inaudible> 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 Shams Khatan, daughter of Malik Shah Sultan Lodi, his first cousin Bibi Amba, daughter of a Hindu goldsmith <laughs> Death Balul died on July 1489 after a long reign. His tomb is a drab place compared to other mausoleums. It is a square chamber with three arched openings on all sides, surmounted by five domes, the central one being the biggest. Quranic verses are inscribed on the arches but there is hardly any other ornamentation. See also Sher Shah Suri Janpur Sultanate Sheikh Samal Din Kambo Tomb of Balul Lodi. Equals equals notes. <laughs>